Hi guys, welcome back to Hope is Alive channel. Got an email from a place where I'm doing some study from Dr. Ross Schroeder. And it was just about keep improving and I thought I'd share some of the things that he had in there. 1 Corinthians 9.25, everyone who competes in the games goes into strict training. Today we're living really in a society where everyone has destination disease. Too many people want to do enough to arrive and then they want to retire. Uh, everyone's looking for a quick fix, but what they really need is fitness. People who look for fixes stop doing what's right when pressure is relieved. People who pursue fitness do what they should no matter what the circumstances are. People who are constantly improving themselves make three processes an ongoing cycle in their lives. And I thought these were really good points. Number one is preparation. When people are intentional about learning something every day, then they become better prepared to handle whatever challenges they meet along the way. The second one is contemplation. Time alone is essential to improving yourself. It allows you to gain perspective on your failures and your successes so that you can learn from them. You remember, we live in a society that doesn't like failure. And I suggest that it's not failure that's the problem, it's quitting is the problem. We all fail, but it's what you learn in the failure which helps you gain success for the future. So that gives you time and space to sharpen your personal and your organisational vision. It enables you to plan how you can improve things in the future. Bruce Springsteen once said, a time comes when you need to stop waiting for the man that you want to become and start being the man you want to be. In other words, you need to apply what you've learned. That way, you can pursue just not self-improvement but it's not self-improvement it's improving yourself as a man of God it's improving yourself as a better husband as a father as a friend as a colleague and you do that by just constantly learning don't wait to morph into something like a butterfly because you're not a butterfly you might travel light but you're not a butterfly instead apply what you've learned and make yourself better that way anyway that's the scripture Everyone who competes in the games goes into strict training. We are not in games, but we're in a journey of life. It's called the kingdom of God. It's about serving Jesus and knowing him. So I just pray that your training goes well and the lessons learned will help you. Bless. Hey, thanks very much for watching Hope is Alive channel. For more videos, you can click here or here. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. Send it to your friends. Take care can choose now and yeah, just anyway yeah.